In this work, we present a novel convolutional neural network called Pulp FrontNet. Our CNN addresses the human pose estimation task, running aboard a nano-sized unmanned aerial vehicle, and predicting the subject's relative pose from the images acquired with a low-resolution onboard camera. To achieve this challenging goal, we adopt a crazy fly nano drone equipped with the AI Deck Companion Board, where we exploit fast and energy efficient computation on the GAP 8 parallel ultra low power system on chip. Pulp FrontNet comes in three variants, allowing for trade off exploration on the memory footprint, the number of multiply and accumulate operations, and regression performance. Every variant has different requirements, but all of them show a negligible drop in performance when comparing the full precision Flow 32 version versus the 8 bit quantized one which is needed for full deployment aboard the Nano drone. Focusing on the absolute performance on the test set, all variants perform similarly on the X and Y component, while for Z and Theta the biggest model seems to outperform the others. We tested our CNN with reproducible in-field experiments. We asked multiple people to perform a predefined path while recording both their and the drone's position with an external motion capture system. To ensure objective measurements across runs, we asked subjects to completely ignore the drone behavior as they move, which we found pretty simple to achieve thanks to the drone's small size. To control the subject's motion, we added markers to the floor for each step to be taken, and we made use of a metronome to mark a rhythm to the person's movements. On the left side of the video, a top-down representation of the testing field is reported. Both the nano drones in the subject's true position are shown with solid colors, while the pale marker shows the onboard prediction made by the drone. We play the onboard video stream on the top right side of the video, which feeds the CNN running on the onboard pulp system on chip. Finally, in the bottom right corner, we show the external view of the experiment. Each CNN's prediction is sent to the Crazy Fly main microcontroller, where it is used to calculate in real time the desired set point to keep a frontal position at 1.3 meter from the subject. In this way, the ultimate behavior of our autonomous nano drone is to follow the human subject with a constant distance. This experiment challenges the drone with increasing difficulty, reaching a standing target in phase 0, following a target that moves without changes in orientation in phases 1 to 4, keeping track of a target that moves and rotates in phase 5 and staying in front of a target that spins in place in phase 6. Note that phases 5 to 7 test the drone's ability to predict the orientation of the subject's head, which is the most challenging component of the pose to predict, as shown in previous results. If you want to know more about our work, check out the publications on both Archive and IEEE web pages, fork our code from GitHub, and follow us on YouTube and Twitter.